Hello, YouTubers, and all those who happen to watch. Alright, so today we're going to be reviewing Soul of Darkness by Gameloft. Now, of course, this game is only 5 bucks on the DSi Store, or the eStore, for all those who own the 3DS. Now, this game takes a lot from the Castlevania, or the Metroidvania style of gameplay. And I'll show you that in quite a couple moments of what I'm talking about with the Metroidvania. As you're, you're greeted to a very, you know, tripmatic, very, you know, if you're on shrooms, it probably would have blow your freaking mind kind of uh, pentagram here. And you're greeted to a profile menu. Now, of course, you are obviously going to get the intro, blah, blah, blah. But, alright. As you are greeted, gives you a, loads up the screen, game for you, it goes blah, 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 gives you some hints. And it also saves you in certain spots, so if you get in a certain spot of a game or the map, and you want to take a break, uh, depending on where you go, it'll backtrack you or keep you up to a point up to so far, and it'll allow you to go back and play this uh, spot again. Again, the graphics on this game are okay for what it is. I mean, obviously they could have been a much more original with the style, but you can't truly complain for what you're getting with this game. I mean, it offers some nice little hidden things here and there, and some replayability with going backtracking and uh, going through uh, older levels because you have extra weapons, for example, like a spear. You can throw it against a wall, and you can catch up on it right there because obviously there's a roof there, but it's practically acquiring some ideas from Quackshot there with the whole entire throw something into a wall and you can jump on it and... Oh yeah, this is gonna be fun. As well as criticals, you practically get little arena modes where you kill monsters, you, for a reward you get a chest full of uh, these little items here, which are of course used for leveling up your power on your weapons. So if you got the fire sword and the ice spear, you'll be able to upgrade those accordingly. Now again, this game does have its grind to it as well. I mean, again, if you want to have a really powerful weapon, there's a lot of repetition of you going back and forth, killing monsters, and collecting these little uh, purple crystals here, and being able to upgrade accordingly. So if you want to upgrade your magic for this weapon or the spear, you can be able to upgrade the spear. If you want to upgrade your fire spell, which, quite frankly, I think is kind of useless, then you can do so accordingly. So, I mean, again, it, it offers some good stuff, it has offers some replayability, and it's not a completely horrible game at all, it's not, it's really enjoyable. It could have been more original, but they offer some fresh ideas, too. I doubt Castlevania would have done right away. Now, I'll show you some gameplay as I'm playing this. Again, you can see some of the ideas making sh taking shape and form. So, you know you're not going to get it ripped off too much. So you're supposed to become a er, a uh, water spirit, but yet it's not letting me do it. <laughs> Let's see. Lack of MP. Yeah, okay, buddy. So yeah, if you guys were thinking about grabbing this game, I would definitely do it. I mean, it's not a completely bad game at all. If anything, it's actually quite refreshing. And it's good value. I mean, for five bucks, you can either get a five burgers or you can play this game. Or probably play better than me, who knows. You can become a beetle. 
Yay! I could become Elton John. Let's actually try some of this out. This looks kind of cool. I mean, some ideas are pretty cool. I mean, I like the shape shifting. Oh god. Oops. Oops, that was a bomb. Derp. No rewards. Let's take a picture or something. He didn't get anything. Typical. Oh well, you guys get the point. Game's pretty good. You've seen some gameplay there. Refreshing, it's interesting, and it's cheap. Why not? This is Dan Van Dam of Worth Universe HD telling you, definitely pick up this title. Take care, folks.